You mean to tell me your big back couldn't stay at home instead of dragging your baby out to a concert so that you're out with a bunch of ratchet foolishness? Mm. This goes back to parenting. We wonder why we're raising so many kids in society that can't cope. It's the mothers. We are living in a time where there is no shame around single motherhood or modern women. Why a woman can go to the club with a child and not be shamed is beyond me. So today, we're going to look at why the world laughs at single moms and modern women. So sit back, relax, and get ready because we're going to be going deep into the abyss. <laughs> What's going on everybody and welcome back to another video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, tickle that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload content, you know what we're going to do. Say it with me. Roll that clip. The single moms, daddy's maybe, mama's baby. You have to take care of this child regardless and y'all are doing a terrible job. Couldn't have said it better myself because you know what? Modern women are terrible mothers. They are so terrible. Why would you have a child with a modern woman who wants to be a single mom? The mentality of modern women today is so bad that they would rather shake butt and get attention rather than look for quality men. So, do you think that when you shake ass in the camera and stuff, like men are gonna look at this and be like, you know, that's a girl who I wanna make my wife? I don't give a fuck. What did you say? I don't want these. Let me tell you something, baby. I was raised by my father. Fuck you, niggas. I, I date one of you niggas that I keep two in the chamber. What? So, do at all times, at all times. Fuck you niggas, I don't give a fuck. I'm my wife. What you, what do you, you not want to be a wife one day though? The question. Do you not want to be a wife one day though? When I'm old, when I'm old. When I'm old. When I'm old. No. Shake ass. I need to know your connotation yeah, yeah, of wife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause I'm a lot of niggas wife. When I'm old. No. Okay. But I'm a but lot of niggas baby. type. Do you have a ring? I got I a few. I got plenty of rings. Bitch, I forgot to put my other piece ring up. on. I'm iced out. Let me put but, the light on that but, shit. But has a man of a ring? Let's put the ice on that shit. Yeah. This is why the world laughs at modern women and single moms because the rest of society doesn't do this. If you look at other races of people, you can see that Asians don't do it, Indians don't do it, Arabs don't do it, but why oh why does the black woman do it? And every time women try to give black women a pass, and try and stick up for black women, what usually happens, they're always on some goofy mess. They're always trying to bring the community down. That's the reason why the passport bros are so big. And then simps and losers that stick out and talk bad about the passport bros, listen, you're just mad that you can't go overseas. You are so dumb. You are really dumb. For real. One of the main reasons why the world laughs at single moms and modern women is because they don't understand accountability. Modern women run from accountability like a black person runs from bails. Hi, Mr. Foltz. We're calling about $300 that you owe T-Mobile. They're no longer interested in calling you about it because you ignored them. So we're calling to see if we can get it now. Fam, it's 2022. You could have sent me a text or an email. I could have ignored you that way. Secondly, if I didn't have the money to give to the person I owed it to, what makes you think I got it to give to you? They run from accountability so much that they use 
shame, insults, guilt, and the need to be right to justify why the man is always the issue. If you talk to any woman in today's society, 98% of the time, they'll always say what a man did, why they don't like a man, why they don't like their ex, why they don't like their baby dad, why they don't like their father, but nobody ever says, what did they do? Women who are bitter and angry can always find a reason to blame the men can always point the finger. He didn't do this. He didn't do that. He this, he that. Never internalizing and looking at themselves. We've all seen the stats. Women initiate divorce more than men. I've done plenty of videos on why, but again, to rehash that fact. A lot of women make emotional decisions and make them permanent decisions based on their emotions. Oh. If a woman may not feel emotionally fulfilled, emotionally needed, emotionally wanted, then they will emotionally check out. And that is why a lot of women divorce. Men, aren't you tired of being blamed for everything? Why can't these women take accountability? Why can't these women understand that they slept with a dog and ended up with fleas? Why can't they just accept accountability and realize that maybe it's their fault that they're not getting married? Why can't they take accountability? Well, here's why. Because they simply don't want to and society allows them the opportunity and the proclivity to not take accountability. There's no more shame against single motherhood. There's no shame for having more baby showers than bridal showers. There's no shame anymore. So when you live in a society that not only doesn't shame things, but openly encourages the breakdown and degeneracy of the black community, here you have it. We have what we call the modern day society. Yep. So here we have the modern day society that has now created the modern day woman. So when you look at that from a statistical standpoint and you look at facts, data, and statistics, you see that the statistical data supports the modern day society creating the modern woman. What man in their right mind is going to deal with a modern woman in a modern society with the modern society creating the modern woman? Think about that. Anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, tickle that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload content. And until the next video, peace.